Imagine being in a laboratory, not unlike the one you are in now, over a thousand years ago, long before the science of chemistry existed. With little understanding of chemical processes to serve man's burning curiosity, the early alchemists risked their lives in makeshift laboratories as they fearlessly sought to unravel life's secrets, often with explosive results. It wasn't until the end of the ninth century that the first scientific breakthroughs were made, thanks to a few brilliant Muslim scientists. These men transformed the mystical practice of alchemy into the science of chemistry. So much of what we take for granted today is possible because of the contributions of these men. Plastics and other lightweight petrochemical derivatives, soaps, shampoos, deodorants, and perfumes. But I'm getting ahead of myself. Let's go back to the beginning of the story. Step back in time with me to an extraordinary period of history and experience the genius and inventions of these great scholars. The story begins with Jabir ibn Hayyan, the father of chemistry. Jabir was the son of an apothecary and perfume maker, so chemistry was in his blood. His curiosity was vast, and he was without doubt one of the greatest experimenters of his time, transforming alchemy into chemistry. Jabir was the first to perfect the alembic still and many of its processes. He systemized chemistry, classifying materials into spirits, metals, and minerals. He built the first scale to accurately weigh materials. His work on the constitution of metals survived over 1,000 years with little change. He performed groundbreaking work on acids and developed the concept of the alkali. He created an acidic mixture to dissolve precious metals and discovered the acids in citrus fruits and vinegar. Jabir even invented fire-resistant paper. His inventions and discoveries impacted everyday life through a wide range of useful products, like synthesizing the essential oils and fragrances used in soaps and perfumes, glistening artificial pearls and colored gemstones, beautifully colored glass, fabrics, Persian carpets, tiles, and ceramics. Despite the dangers of his work, the cuts, burns, vapors, and explosions, Javer lived to the ripe old age of 93. 